a heavily armed man who led police on a high-speed chase across two counties ended when he was shot multiple times. The unidentified male crashed on Thursday afternoon after exchanging gunfire with officers in Oakland, California, according to KTVU. He was rushed to hospital after being hit with multiple shots as he wore a bulletproof vest. Share this article Share Vallejo Police Captain Lee Horton told the broadcaster they had received a call from a credible person that the suspect was outside their house in his car with weapons. As police moved in to intercept the SUV the shooter made off at high speed, clocking over 120 miles per hour in the 30-mile chase. The Ford Explorer tried to ram officers on I-80 as it approached Oakland before he smashed into a pole and bullets were sent flying at 4. 25 p.m. CPT. Horton told KTVU. He was heavily armed with rifles, assault weapons, a handgun and the caller was fearful and he let our officers know that. He continued, we have reports that the suspect did fire at our officers during the pursuit. The police say he had multiple assault weapons and was alone in the black SUV. No pedestrians were injured as the chase ended in carnage in broad daylight. CPT. Horton told the broadcaster the decision to chase the suspect into a heavily populated area would not have been taken lightly. Of course pursuits are dangerous, but so is a person with assault rifles and pistols, putting more people in danger, he said, and so it's a judgment call, a difficult decision officers have to make on their own. The suspect is in hospital with no report on his condition. It is not yet known why he was parked so heavily armed outside the house in Vallejo.